je suis avec la France, je suis musulman, je suis pratiquant, mais je ne suis pas pour le terrorisme. Al-Qaïda, tout ça. Non, 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 non. Moi, je combats Al-Qaïda, moi. Ah, je tire sur Al-Qaïda. T'as pas à venir tuer les gens d'ici. We just got to Eiffel Tower. It's just been closed. This is the second time since the attacks that it's been closed for security reasons. France just announced that 115,000 security forces will be dispatched across the country. I can already see some soldiers on the ground. I mean, this is one of the most crowded, symbolic areas in France. And to see it so deserted is very sad. Je vous invite à quitter le parvis. Merci. Excuse me, what's, what's going on? Is there a security problem? Or? Yes, security problem. Please, security you problem? must go. So it's been closed? Everybody go. So we don't know what's happening, but we hear there's a security risk and we're being evacuated out of the area. So you, you guys are tourists? We are. We are. We're, we're American. We're American. And you came to, to see the Eiffel Tower? We, did, we actually came for the U2 concert, which was canceled. Um, and then, yeah, so today we came to see the Eiffel Tower. And so uh, we're, we're not giving up. So eventually it'll open and we'll get to go in. It's certainly been a trip of a lifetime. Sure. How do you guys feel uh, being tourists after the attack? We had 9-11 and we know how we felt. Yeah. We actually went yesterday and uh, took flowers yeah. and went to the different sites and laid flowers and, and just spent some time just uh, really mourning. You can't hide away. You can't live in fear. So you move forward and, and you uh, live in liberty regardless. So that's, that's what we're doing today. So we're getting pushed even further back away from the Eiffel Tower right now. What's happening here? There was, there was a bomb. What, what happened? We are from India. We are from you know. We have seen what has happened in Mumbai. Not so. Yeah many years back. And you think this is a part of our new reality that like this is, there might be bomb alerts, there might is, be like is, uh, false alarms, we just have to continue absolutely. living. This is, this is, I mean we should now understand this is a new global reality we are living in. Yeah. At least from where I come from in the world, we have been facing all these issues for long, long enough. Things are quieting down now. We just got off the phone with the Paris police. They have nothing to confirm yet, but it seems like it might have been a scare. Since the attack, there have been many of these. The whole city is very tense. So we're walking in, in the area where the attacks happened. There's a huge memorial site here with lots of flowers and candles and, and people are very silent. Um, we're going to be headed to a sports bar around the corner because France is playing tonight, another soccer match. And we're going to see how the mood is and if people feel confident to return to this area again. Do you have like any like hesitation or second thoughts before coming, like a little fear? No, I'm not scared because it's happened one time, it can't happen yeah. and second time and if if you're scared you do nothing in your life, so do you do you know anyone uh, who was in the attack? Yes. 
You did? Yes, I did. Wow. Are they okay? Some yes, some not. Yeah, I think everybody everybody in Paris or in France knows someone who knows someone who was close to here and there was a lot of people who died. So. Is it strange to be out and about in this neighborhood when only just a few days ago a terrorist attack happened here? Mm -hmm. It's so weird. It looks, everything looks different, everything looks strange. I like that it has a really strange atmosphere and you know that something happened. Everybody is kind. You know, like, oh, are you okay? You need some help? And yeah. Yes, I think everybody is more like human. <laughs> <laughs> We know from this morning's raids that several have been arrested. A woman blew herself up with a suicide vest. And at the moment, the area has been completely sealed off and evacuated. So what did you hear this morning? Bah, disons, vers le coup de 4h15, on a entendu des coups de feu. Ouais, comme tout le monde, à peu près les personnes des habitants de Saint-Denis. On a tous entendu la même chose. Au début, on a cru que c'était des pétards, comme euh, des nanas, mais bon, à 4h du matin, c'est pas des petits qui jouent aux pétards, quoi, en fait. Et c'est de là qu'on s'est rendu compte que ça tirait vraiment, en fait, euh, à la calage, c'était des, des, des bruits d'armes euh, automatiques, en fait. Bah, pour moi, une des têtes qui cherchait depuis un certain moment euh, s'est rendue ici. Are you terrified that there are people in your neighborhood who are involved in terrorist activities? Non, non, pas de terrorisme, non, non, non. On n'est pas d'accord là-dessus. Je n'ai pas peur parce que je me dis que c'est des choses qui se passent, qui se passent un peu partout, qui se passent en Irak, qui se passent en Afghanistan, qui se passent en Libye, aux États-Unis. Tout ça, ça se passe un peu partout. Je suis avec la France. Je suis musulman. Je suis pratiquant, mais je ne suis pas pour le terrorisme. Chez nous, dans l'islam, on ne tue pas. Personne doit tuer. Al Qaïda, tout ça. Non, 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 non. Moi, je combats Al Qaïda, moi. Ah, je tire sur Al Qaïda. T'as pas à venir tuer des gens d'ici. Ouais, les Français, les, les, des pères de famille, des mères de famille, des enfants, qui n'ont rien à voir. Je suis le premier à partir combattre. Euh, voilà. Do you have any friends who are inside? Euh, ouais, avec, il y en a un qui en a parlé avec un. Bah, en fait, il nous a dit que lui, il était, il était dans son appartement et il a entendu des coups de feu, etc. Et la police est venue directement chez lui, en fait. Et ils ont tous sorti, euh, main sur la tête, etc. Voilà. Et ils, entendu des, ils ont entendu des coups de feu, beaucoup d'échanges de tirs, et voilà. C'est déjà que, enfin, en Seine-Saint-Denis, on est mal vu. Donc avec euh, les terroristes, les kamikazes qui viennent, euh, ouais, ça, ça va, encore ça va être compliqué, vu, ouais. ça, va être ça va être on va être encore plus mal vu, en fait. Ouais. The raid has been declared over. Seven have been arrested, at least two have been killed. 